Hi, today we are going to see about the evolution of GSM or the history of GSM. One key factor for the success of GSM was that the standardization work was not completed after 1989. It was initially decided that GSM would evolve over time. With improvements in computing and radio access technology, GSM will offer continuous improvement and more services. Okay. So how the history of GSM started? In 1982, CEPT initiated a new cellular system. The European Commission issued a directive which required member states to reserve frequencies in the 900 MHz band for GSM to allow for roaming. In 1985, CEPT made a decision on time schedule and action plan. In 1986, CEPT tested eight experimental systems in Paris. In 1987, the Memorandum of Understanding, which is called the MOU, was signed. Allocation of the frequencies. 890 to 915 MHz, uplink from mobile to base station. 935 to 960 MHz downlink from base station to mobile. In 1988, the European Telecommunication Standard Institute, which is called the ETSI, was created, includes members from administrations, industries and user groups. In 1989, the final recommendations and specifications for GSM Phase 1 was done. In 1990, validation systems implemented and the first GSM World Congress in Rome with 650 participants. In 1991, the first official call in the world with GSM on 1st July. In 1992, the world's first GSM network was launched in Finland. By December, there were 13 networks operating in seven areas. Australian operators were the first non-European signatories of the GSM MOU. New frequency allocation for GSM 1800, 1710 to 1785 MHz uplink, 1805 to 1880 MHz downlink. GSM demonstrated for the first time in 19 then in 1993. GSM demonstrated for the first time in Africa at Telcom 93 in Cape Town. Roaming agreements between several operators were signed. By December 1993, there were 32 GSM networks operating in 18 areas. In 1994, the first GSM network in Africa was launched in South Africa. The GSM Phase 2 data fax bearer services were launched. By December 1994, there were 69 GSM networks in operation. The GSM MOU is formally registered as an association in Switzerland with 156 members from 86 areas. The GSM World Congress was held in Madrid with 1,400 participants. In 1995, there were 117 GSM networks operating around the world. Fax, data and SMS roaming was implemented. The GSM Phase 2 standardization was completed, including adaptation for GSM 1900. The first GSM 1900 network was implemented. The first GSM 1900 network was implemented in the USA. Telecom 95 was held in Geneva, where Nokia demonstrated 33.6 kbits multimedia data via GSM. In 1996, by December, there were 120 networks operating. The 8K SIM was launched in addition to prepaid GSM SIM cards. In 1998, high-speed circuit switch data HSCSD trials in Singapore. Over 2 million GSM 1900 users in the USA and a total of 120 million GSM 900, 1800, 1900 users worldwide. In 1999, the first mobile data call using GPRS, General Packet Radio Service, in a live network was made. In late August, there were 344 GSM networks operating in 127 different countries. And by the end of the year 1999, there were 250 million GSM users worldwide. This is the history of GSM.